Hello everybody, welcome back to Anvil. So the last episode we got a ton done. We got the armor ups, uh, the, the tier 3 armor. It looks like they got the helms just made too. We, Me and Bill Gates, we spent so much time getting everything up to tier 3 within our whole kingdom so that we could upgrade to tier 3. It's actually pretty crazy that two people were able to do all that stone hauling. I have some really long let's plays. Um, and yeah, they've done a lot of work. Done a lot of work. Dang. You guys got a lot done. Yeah. It's coming together. Yeah, Bill and I got us, got everything up to tier 3 last night. It was a huge pain in the ass. But it was really worth it yeah, to, to see the armor. Yeah, it's super nice. Yeah, the game where the game is, Go9 is is PvE. Like we were killing wolves no problem in leather armor and stuff. And you're getting we got like um three torches for one of the dens and we got like 50 silver and a ton of ore ton of items like cool. so with the, this my hope is with this armor and some good weapons and a bunch of torches like we could just go clear these pve sites and make a ton of money we're thinking of uh getting up to traps so we can yeah yeah the bears for yeah. 30 seconds and yeah but it takes a lot of shit yeah uh, yeah we that's what that's where we left off yesterday, is thinking about the traps over here. Have you guys heard me? No. No, no, no for a while. Only spirits really. Oh, shit. Did. Only, like, in spirit, though. I was like, man, these guys just ignored me now. <laughs> <laughs> no, we couldn't hear you. So... My voice. Sorry about that. Did he tell you about the, uh, the attack? Oh, no, what, what happened? Oh, no. There we go. I was like... Four people us. came in and attacked. Yeah, that's why I wanted to get the wall up, but it's kind of a pain. It's yeah, just... the infantry came through. They came and helped us out, and we just slaughtered them. All four of them yeah. didn't take a single hit. I'm kind of ups upset. I missed that. That would have been cool, but that's all right. Uh, it will probably we... happen again. They're in the area. We're... No, we're we're, uh, we're gonna get steamrolled here shortly. Oh, great! That's awesome. Cause that sword fort. This is all the stuff yeah, I was saying while Akshire I was muted, is going. but Sword Fort is gone. Um, they're in Akshire next, and they'll be coming here next, if that's, not. That's fantastic. To the east. That's fantastic. That's cool. And we are the only ones that log in at this entire settlement. Yeah, but at least I'm, we... I'm looking like... at the map, and there's so many like less settlements now. I'm pretty sure it's from all the people that like got on, played for a day, and yeah. stopped. Yeah, but I'm looking. I'm looking forward to seeing the conclusion. I mean, the, the game's gonna go out tomorrow, so that's. I actually, honestly, hope we get burned to the ground because that would be cool. <laughs> I want to see it. <laughs> I'm better. I want to see it. All right. So, what do we need to to get this trapper up? It's not much. It's just eight shaped stone and like some bone. Yeah, you want to come kill some wolves with me? Yeah. Know where some are. Yeah, let me um, let me get geared up. I need to get some food in this guy too, cause he's. All right. Yeah. So we're we're in good shape. I feel like I can't use that. That's kind of crazy. Um. All right. We're gonna go out and kill boars. I want to take a pickaxe with me in case we find any kind of iron ore. So this game is really involved. It's a lot like Foxhole from what people tell me. However, I never played Foxhole and um. It seems like you can build things up very quickly, especially if you have people helping you. However, if you're by your lonesome, um, it, it, it's a crying. You really do need a good amount of people. Um, ooh, wow, Kellen, sword. All right. 
I just need to get some food in this guy. All we have are berries, right? We should have more. We might have burned through it. In here. Yeah, this guy's super mal malnourished from dying. In the, uh, the chest. I need to get some food too. You made boiled cabbage. Yeah, it's good for stamina. Nice. Yeah, this guy, I'm all kinds of messed up. Even after having a real meal, I'm still messed up. Oh, damn, this boiled cabbage is amazing. Provides healing for 360 seconds, increases health by 25. That's pretty good. Especially I think they all do that. Essentially, if you eat it, it's going to regenerate your health. It just uh, depends how high your health is, your max. But that cabbage cooks so fast relative to, to meats, though. Yeah, yeah, that's a... Like, the meat takes like a minute, this takes 28 seconds. That's a lot faster for, for mass producing. I wonder what wheat, like bread and stuff does. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that's a good, that's a good concept. Well, let's go, um... No, I need to eat one more time before we go so I can get my health to at least 75%. You ate berries, meat, and cabbage, and you're still bad? I thought you could only eat one at a time. No, you want to eat all the different oh, types shit. of food. shit, I didn't know that. <laughs> Dude, I You've suck. Been one I, at a time, I, su time. I suck at this game so bad. <laughs> yeah, so that's why you want to get a variety. I got you. I got, I guess I was so e used to eating one type of food, I just thought it applied to everything. We need to get, sh yeah, we need yeah. to get sh uh, shields too. I'd like the um, tier two shields would be pretty dope. If we get enough bone, let's get the trapper up first, and then let's actually see if the trapper requires bone for any of the traps before we use it. But I think if we could get shield and swords, like we could be, we could be easily rolling people. Well, not fifty people, but ideally at this point, I just want to get enough so that we can start stockpiling this settlement mm. because there's only. It seems like there's only two of us online at a time. So essentially, if they come in with 50 people like they've been doing, then it's not even a fight. We're just gonna die. It's gonna be no fun. And there goes. Are the they settlement. are they destroying settlements? How? Um, probably or, siege damage. Are they torches. using torches on the um, the banner? Is there's that... also there's also oil oil flasks that do a lot of siege damage. Yeah, that's why. Like, if I would have done this, which what I would have done is gated in the flag like heavily you know what i mean because if they can't get to the flag they can't destroy the whole base that easily it's basically like a yeah. monu mo monument you know oh shit did you take much damage no i got two bone how much did you get one all right cool question um how how is the armor? Have you fought much in it? Seems pretty good so far. I haven't taken right. any damage. All right, I got damage three bones. The chainmail first. Yeah, weapon cannot damage. Wait, 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 wait. So we've been throwing torches. Do you think if we held the torch and beat on this, it would damage it? Like maybe we don't need to throw the torches. Maybe. No, because you when you attack, you attack with your right arm. I've been able to swing torches, though. Yeah, but you're still punching if you don't have anything out. I, I'm just curious. I'm wondering if there's a siege weapon. I got four bones. Are these gray wolves? I, I got one. You can go get some more. I say we keep going until we can't go. Until the armor's about to break. How's your armor? Full. <laughs> I must be taking all the hits. <laughs> yeah, I think you are. 
Well, this is a fresh armor. I, I just... Uh... Oh, mine was too. But I'm at like 33%. Oh, wow. Okay, so the armor's taken most... That's cool, though, because we can repair it really cheap, so... I love this this armor, though. I think it's a huge advantage. Oh, shit, gray. Or brown. Let me take... Oh, shit. Dude, I barely got hurt. Yeah, I believe the chainmail actually absorbs it, whereas the leather absorbs some. Dude, we're gods. We're gods. I wonder if we could take a bear. It'll probably break the armor really quick. Yeah, but imagine. <laughs> if we I could mean, take it'll a be, bear. It's, you, you have a buffer at that point, so it's not nearly as bad. Yeah, but if like three of like three of us came in with fresh armor on those bears, we could. I mean, we could. You, you've, you've underestimate how many swings it takes. Like uh, I said, we had one dead. bugged out, and we were swinging at it constantly for a few minutes without it dying. The brown ones. After we shot it full of arrows. Oh god! Oh, it's another one. All right, we should have brought torches. Yeah, we're missing out on a lot of loot. That's okay. We were coming for the bone, so I got the bone. I got six bone. That's more than enough to uh, do what we need to do. Oh, there's another one. Yeah, I got there. seven now. I think we killed all of them. All right, I think we're good. Yeah, that's enough bone for the shields and the upgrade. But I want to see if we need bone for the traps before we do the shields. But the shields would, um, yeah, shields with the armor. I think we could take a bear. But then again, I think you got creamed by that bear in two hits when you had a shield. But I don't know if the tier two shield plus the tier two armor would make a substantial. I mean, I. Personally, I feel like this that armor... was a, that was the actual shield. It wasn't the wooden shield. Oh, okay, I feel like this armor is substan it's... substantially better than the leather, though. Like that would have killed me in leather, like the wolf. Well, I believe the way it works, because you can only hold the shield up for so long before it gets maxed out and you drop it. So you put it down, get your stamina back up, so you can put it back up again, and your chainmail absorbs the damage while it's down. Mm -hmm. Gotcha. And if you have multiple people, then, yeah, shouldn't be as bad. Yeah, I think what we needed to do was gate in this flag. Um, so pe now, because then they couldn't just walk up to it. They'd have to take a battering ram to the gate and stuff. But yeah, they could just stroll in with any kind of siege equipment and destroy this place just by destroying this flag. Yeah, well, I mean, this wall probably takes a few torches to break down. Yeah, good point. I w what I mean is though I would have like once you got the once we could do stone like we could like st what I would do next time like you build a settlement is stone this flag like protect this but, flag yeah but I'm not even worried about the flag it's the settlement the building that you got to worry about that's the oh, one they're, they're going be targeting. You, you, you say okay I got you and then that screws everything who's sweet all right we got all this meat I'm gonna go do we have stone, or do we need to collect stone? We got some. Yeah, one thing I wish is it would allow you to cook more than one thing at a time. That way you could like go do yeah. some, do some stuff and then come back and empty. Maybe like two or three. Like I understand not having an infinite amount, but I'm starting to think more big picture, so it does make a little more sense. Um, I put my bone in your thing. It's like it makes getting food more of a chore, so it's not just easy to be completely stocked up all the time and if you need more food just I'll oh, just throw it in there and go grab it later I'm gonna get my hammer so when you have 50 people that you have to feed you know it becomes more important 
yeah, essentially, you can't really have dead weight in this game. And unfortunately, that is a, you know, a very common thing. Um, every game I play, it's always yelling, like, there's always a group of people who don't appreciate the cost of an item, who log in, lose those items, and don't do any of the crafting. That's why the I rather have I rather teach a crafter how to PvP than a PvP person how to craft. It's just um it's just the way it is. Okay. Gotta repair it. Oh, we gotta repair the building, my bed. I'm just like swinging and I'm so fucking brain dead right now. <laughs> just swinging in the air at nothing. <laughs> Just waiting to get rolled. I just want to discover as much as possible about the game before we get rolled. You see the oil flask, yeah. throwable high siege. Look how yeah, cheap that is, dude. Earlier. We, we could go burn down all of those wolf dens probably with one of those. Look how cheap it is, dude. It's just five leather and some animal fat. That's way uh, easier I'd than use, torches. I, would, I wouldn't use those on wolf dens. I well, I mean, like torches the bear. For sure we for could wolf go. Dens, we could go get dens, the bear yeah. dens. We should actually do that. Dude, you see the traps? It's animal fat in a board. It's nothing. See how fucking cheap that is? Yeah, no, I'm wondering if that's like for rabbits and stuff. <laughs> <laughs> We're gonna go try to get a bear with this shit and get totally wrecked. It's, it's a rabbit trap. Don't. Well, yeah, but that's passive meat. Yeah, that's a little too cheap. The oil flask, though, for bear dens, that's pretty dope. Because, like, five leather is nothing. That's that's just five deer. And we can get... And you remember how much leather those bear dens drop. Alright, I got it. I hear, um... All right, I got a trap going. You should make an oil flask, though. And we should actually test it out on a wolf den just to see if it, it can one-shot it. It's, it's for science. <laughs> I'm sure it would. It only takes, like, three torches to kill a wolf den and, like, eight for an elite one, if that. All right, I got a trap, dude. Look at this thing. It's like a, this is a totally bear trap, man. Like, uh, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go test it. All right, I'm de I'm game. I mean, we could test it on a wolf. That would be a, a worthy adversary. But if we could trap bears with this, holy cow! I say we try it on the bear right away. We need All to right. get that iron. Are you, are you ready? I gotta repair my armor, get some more food. I'm gonna put my hammer back, but I have my pickaxe on me and everything I need. Oh yeah, we're gonna test out this trap. Yeah, I think if you had 10 solid dudes and you were smart and you had a fort within a fort and you had a way of making money, this would be really easy. Right now, we have a very inefficient build. I got four animal bone on me, too. I'm going to put it in one of these carts. I'm also going to make some... I'm going to make some of those explosives for the bear den. I 
I, I don't know how you can say no to explosives. We need some more leather. You think we could throw the explosives at the bear? I don't think it'll do much. It's just siege damage. Yeah, you're probably right, but it would be... Yeah, it's siege damage, so... I'm making some explosives, though, for um, blowing up the bear den. We, I mean, we got a tech... I mean, we spent all the time getting to tier 3. We gotta, we gotta see this shit. But yeah, they could just use these on the gates and probably bust right through a gate. And these are so cheap. You could easily have every single person with one of these. If just like five of these can blow up a bear den, though, like we could be farm. Like the next time they do this game, like I would just go straight for tier three to get to this. And then you could just farm bear dens all day. All right. Do you wanna um? I'll when we're ready to go, we can each take five from this barrel. Are you are you ready? Let me stash this stuff and then yeah. I want to see this trap. This is so cool, man. Imagine if we had five other people. <laughs> just yeah, just like or two, <laughs> just two other people. Once you have a yeah, I'm waiting. I'm waiting for the original guy, like I did the all nighter with, to log back on. He seemed like he was gonna be on, but yeah, well, you I'm know, bones in this one too. People just kind of... Do we want to do shields before we go? Do we have enough material? Uh, we should. It's just like we have the bones and there's some... I don't know what else we need for it. Boards and... I think you need iron for the uh, tier one, yeah. tier twos. Do whatever tier you can do. I mean, a shield, no, one shield, shield's better than no shield, so. And then we can also stock up the, uh... The one thing I don't like, though, is that weapons aren't stocked. You know what I mean? It's like, the armors are, are stocked in high qu quantities, but, like, what about weapons? <laughs> but what good is having that's, a, a full set of fucking armors? That's a balancing thing, for sure. Yeah. Even if you don't want to just, hey, you, you logged on for five minutes, you collected these resources, all right, you got a fully armed, fed army of 50 people. Like it, it makes it to where, okay, you, you want to bring 50 people to attack a base, you got to spend the time to make the weapons. Yeah, yeah that's a good point. Actually. The armor, the armor is kind of like, everyone needs it. I don't know. That's no, all good. Or gonna... it might be excessive if they did it one by one for armor as well. Yeah. Do we want to make shields or what are we thinking? Yeah, I'm just getting the resources. I need the iron. I'm gonna get an iron helmet from the town. Yeah, we're gonna kill this bear properly. If this trap doesn't work though, man. It's gonna be pretty funny. <laughs> it might only work for medium creatures. It might like have a, a size limit. But it's a big trap. That's that's Maybe. No, that's no bunny rabbit trap. I don't know if you saw me with it out. It's huge. It's a bear trap. I did, yeah. Yeah, it's a massive. That or it's just a wonky animation for a freaking rabbit trap. 
You, you never know until you do something. It really is, honestly. Shit, I keep finding more stuff. I need to stash. Sorry. Alright, your armor's all repaired, right? Um, it's like at 95%, so... The chickens keep dying, or what's going on over the chickens? Remember, someone killed them. Oh, I didn't know if they re they were replaced. No, I think at that point it was like fuck it. Okay. Hold on. Oh yeah, that's what I'm talking about. I didn't bring more food, shit. Oh well. I just brought one thing of cabbage. Cabbage, are you okay to go or? Yeah, I'm full health. Just don't have anything to heal after. This guy in chat, full raid party. Or huge raid party. Where? North of uh, Rhymeholm. Making siege camp. We'll, we'll get rolled eventually, but that's okay. We got an that's enemy to, the to east. our east. Yeah, that's to the east of us, Rhymeholm. They'll come for us next. No, no, I mean on the map. Like There's a guy running towards us. One guy. Get him. Kevin? Um. Yeah. Yeah, you're right. Should we go for him or should we go for the... Well, we need to kill him probably. We should go for him. That way he doesn't yeah. sneak up on us, so... Oh, he's gone. Off the radar. So right ahead of us. Yeah, you ran. Dude, you could get lost in these four. We should do this around our whole base. It's thick force. It'd probably help them out more than it would help us, though. I hate. What did when you go into combat that it slows you down like that? I get it. I hate when I accidentally do something that puts me into combat. That's when I get pissed off. All right, so we got bears over there. Okay, so here's the deal. Hold up. There. See the trap? Okay. So can you stand can you stand where I'm standing? Or stand kinda like within range of the trap but not within range of the bear yet? Okay. So I'm gonna I'm gonna lead this bear back. Um but first I kinda wanna throw a potion at that thing and see if I can blow it up. We should before we yeah go for it. We can destroy I to, it. I have to get a little. Go walk away. Yeah, let's. This is kind of stupid. Let's wait for the bear to move a little bit more. There's a wolf there too. Yeah, I think that's stuck though.
Nice. Did we just free that wolf? Yep. Nice. Okay, um, bear trap. One sec. Oh god, I stepped in my own trap. So it works on people. <laughs> it works on people. I was I was trying to pick it up to reposition it and I stepped in it. How do you get it up? Uh, it says I'm trapped for How 30 you... seconds and it's ticking down. So it will trap anything that walks into it for 30 seconds. Did you uh bring another one? I picked it up. It's only one third damaged. So it's reusable. And we should definitely try. Oh shit! Here's that bear. Um. All right. So I'm gonna place it here. So you definitely do not want to touch to to walk into it. All right. Do you want to you want to stand over here behind it and I'll lead the bear into it. I'm actually wondering if I could throw this explosive thing at it to get its attention. Uh, if I throw the explosive at, it, maybe I can get its attention. I wouldn't. I wouldn't waste it like that. I'll go aggro it. Hold on. Yeah, we need a bow and arrows. We need for this. Holy shit! It works. He's trapped for 30 seconds, bro. And we can reuse this trap. Oh, unless he destroys the trap. We should have brought... He's attacking damage. something. Oh, look at that. Nice. I'm curious, because it looked like he was doing the attack animation. Um, it's, too, it's got one more use in it, so he may have been... But it looks like it's every time it traps someone, it goes down one third. We got one more bear. Um, let's just do it again, right? Let me put the trap down. All right, traps down right there. If you want to lead the bear. Dude, we are bear killers now. We can kill bear dens all day. The leather you get from this will make the explosives. Alright, let's go see if there's any um, money. Yeah, there's a loot bag over here. And now we have access. Wow, this leather is for chainmail. Chainmail and iron armor. Oh, yeah. Bearded axes. No money, I don't see. Which any. we. I forgot. We didn't bring the cart with us. We took it to the town, but never took the... We wanted to see if it would work. I mean, we're we're done. Like, we're gonna get rolled here soon. But, uh... Now we know that traps are the way. I mean, like, we could kill bears all day and get iron all day now. Black bears, at least. We need more people for the brown ones. But we could do it. I, yeah, if we had more people. Because you don't need us. Watch out for that bear deer. You're right, Bill. But we could kill bears all day. Um, with we don't need shield and sword. Like I'd probably say we bring two-handed axes for this next time and a bow and arrow to bait the. Like you could literally shoot the bear, have him come right at you, then everyone runs in and just beats the shit out of him, and then boom, you have access to everything. That was crazy. I bought, I got the three weapons, the, the legendary or whatever they're called. But yeah, like what we'd want to do is come out here with two wagons, probably four to five guys. And just kill all the bears and load the wagons up with leather.
So next time when you do all this, I think we want to get the tier the tier three trapper up ASAP, basically. In the next life or whatever. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Keep saying next time. It's like I have no idea when the next thing's even gonna be. Yeah, so the traps work on people too, which is really crazy. So if we if we do get attacked. I got five bones as well off those bears. This is pretty good though. We were yeah, got, we were um, able to explore almost every tier of, of stuff. Is that a guy on our side or How is he down on the ground? Is that him logging? That's what happens when you log out. Yeah. Looked like he was praying. We're, prof we're professional bear killers now, though. I'm pretty stoked that that one trap could capture three bears, up to three bears, too. They were pretty cheap to make. Yeah. So you could all carry, like, two of those. I think they're a good anti... Uh, I think it's a good combat weapon, too, because you could set those down and pull your bow out. And then if you trap anybody, you could just sit there with your bow. Sounds like we're about to lose in the... Yeah, in the next hour, most likely. I'm gonna put these weapons that I got over here. here soon. Hello there. How you doing, man? Was there a wipe uh, this night or something? I lost all my stuff. You, lo you have to put it in the chest, you your body stays in the game when you log. So you die. Basic, you just sit there until you die, basically, when you log off. My chest is uh, empty, too. Even the private. None of it's private. It's only private to the homestead. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah, anybody, unfortunately, the local is like literally anyone can open it, and then the private one is anybody in the Alliance can open it if they're inside our camp. Kind of shitty. Yeah, but <laughs> you learn all the time. Yeah, I'm still picking stuff up. Yeah, we're gonna get steamrolled here within hours i'd say yeah i'm pretty happy i feel like i feel like we learned a lot just in the like knowing how traps work knowing how bears work knowing how to get iron and, and imagine what you could do with a team of 10 people like who are all i mean there's there's still a fighting chance though because i if we can go if we can get that other bear one down red wolf if you want to help us take down some bears and get that iron mine up, and then just start shooting out there to get iron, make some weapons and armor, and then make some camps. That way, when people come in to uh, do reinforcements, they have something to use. But we need that iron mine to do that. Oh, that town's burned to the ground, bro. 
The one northeast of us, it says new ancient home. Look at the um, attention on Ray home. It looks like they're actually making a stand. They're not getting attacked yet, but they're setting up there. Yeah, I think that uh, there's. Do you see that island to the north, or sorry, to the east? That island called Lost Sisters to the east. That's where I think I would set up next time. <laughs> Yeah. Kind of cut off from everybody there, though. Deerfield's not a bad little peninsula in that lake, still in the landmass. Um, can we make another trap? Yeah, they're cheap. And how much leather do we have left? We're gonna need more than 10 for that other one. Shit, I actually might have to log off here in 15 minutes. Oh shit. Dude, you're invisible. The cart's just moving itself with your name above it. Is it really? Yeah, it's really creepy. The ghost of Bill Gates. Are we gonna go kill deer? Yeah, just get some leather. Can we even hit each other? Uh, actually, I guess not, huh? I've never, I'm, I'm always just so used to not trying to hit people, I've never hit, tried to hit anybody. Oh, fuck. Do we want to try to help out, Bill? We gotta help ourselves first. But if we if we can if we can win that battle then they won't come here. Yeah, that's pretty crazy cool that you can set it up for reinforcements like that. So it takes a lot of energy to destroy a town. You're glitched out, Bill. It's, uh, it's full.
Anyway, yeah, I do actually have to go do some things. Otherwise, I would continue the Let's Play. But I'm gonna put my gear away, and... Yeah, unfortunately, we're probably gonna get rolled. I don't really, uh... I don't really foresee us being able to survive. Get rid of... Um, get rid of this flint axe. Alright, thank you guys so much for watching.